I'm Tom from Do-It-Yourself Home Automation, and this is a home automation controller that I built using an old Samsung tablet. So this is basically a tablet probably about three years old, and it didn't have any battery capacity anymore, so I decided to turn it into a little control station over here in my living room. So basically all I did was set it up on a stand and plug it in directly to the wall there. And it's an Android tablet, so I've got the full Android OS on there. And basically what I've done is turn it into a really easy way to control a lot of my home automation systems. So for one thing, you know, I've got, I've got my dogs on there, obviously, but I've got the date and weather and just kind of basic information on the home screen, so I can see that very easily. But then I can also install all of the different apps for different home automation functions. So for example, I've got the Philips Hue app installed over here. And that allows me to control all the lighting in my house from this nice kind of always on screen. So I basically set it up so that it never shuts the screen off for power saving since it's plugged directly into the wall. And that way it's always running and I can just walk over and change the light settings. So if I want to shut off all the lights in the house, for example, I've got this little home screen shortcut and I can just touch that and immediately all my lights will go off. Or if I want to have them all on with a nice warm incandescent setting, I can go in and do that. And then of course I can pull up the full Hue app and that'll allow me to go in and set, you know, crazy scenes if I ever for some reason wanted to. I have no idea why they want to have blue lighting and everything in there. But I can go ahead and do that and control my lights. And there's a whole bunch of other apps, obviously, that you can install in here. So I've just got the lighting set up now. But um, in the future, I'll be adding in a webcam capacity. You can add in uh, features to control your Nest thermostat and all kinds of other Android-based apps. But instead of running them on a phone, you have them here on this nice sort of home-based controller screen.